Hi parents, I just wanted to take a quick moment to show you how we have been learning to add in class with regrouping in the ones and the tens. I hope you find this helpful while completing homework that's due on Thursday or while reviewing for our test that will be sometime next week. As you can see, I created the number 137 plus 100. 97. So when we go to solve an addition problem, we always start in the ones. I can count here and see that I have 14 ones. Can I make a group of 10? Yes. I'm going to take away 10 of them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I have a group of 10. I can regroup. With a 10, I'm going to take this 10 and put it in my tens columns. Tens belong in the tens column. Put these aside. Next, you go to the tens. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 tens. Can I make a group of 100? Yes. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. I can regroup these 100s for a 100, and 100s go in the 100s column. I can see now that I have 334, and that's my answer. I highly recommend you use manipulatives at home. I didn't have any here, so I just made some with a cut up circular, where you can also draw a picture. I think drawing a picture is one of the most helpful things the students can do because I tell them that's a tool that they will always have. They can always, always draw a picture to help them solve a problem like this. I hope you find this helpful and have a good night.